Hello, my dear students. Welcome to our online lesson. Today, we are going to talk about the state of liberty. Assalamu alaikum, formatli talabala. Online darsimiz ga xush kelibsiz. Bugun siz bilan ingliz tilida ozodlik qaykali haqida suhbatlashamiz. Lesson 9. The state of liberty. Doing exercises. 9-chi dars. Ozodlik qaykali. Mashqlar bajarish. Objectives to develop students listening and reading skills to give information about the state of liberty. Darsning Masada Talabalarning Ishtish va Ukush Kunikmalarna Rvojlantarish Talabalarga Ozotli Haikala Hakada Maumot Birish. Outcomes By the end of the lesson, students shall be able to get information about the state of liberty. Darsta Erishaladian Natijalar Darsungida Talabalar Ozotli haykala haqida to'liq ma'lumotga ega bo'lishadi. Exercise number 1. Learn the new words of the text. Birinchi match. Matnning yangi so'zlarini o'rganing. Famous. Famous. Mashhur. Torch. Torch. Mashala. Visitors. Visitors. Tashrif buyuruvchilar. Relationship. Relationship. Uzara aloqalar, pedestal, pedestal, asos fundament, design, design, design koronesh, freedom, freedom, ozotlik. Exercise number two, read the text and translate it into Uzbek. Ikinche mashr, matan oking, va unu Uzbek telge tarjimakling. Text. The State of Liberty One of the famous states in the world stands on an island in New York Harbor. The State of Liberty is a woman who, hold, who holds a torch up high. Visitors can go inside the statue. The state is so large that as, ma as many as 12 people can stand the torch. Many more people can stand in other parts of the statue. The statue weighs 225 tons and 301 feet tall. The State of Liberty was put up in 1886. It was a gift to the United States from the people of France. All the years France and the United States had a special rela relationship. In 1776, France helped the American colonies gain independence from England. The French wanted to do something special for the U.S. Sentinel, its 100th birthday. Labelly was a well-known Frenchman who admired the United States. One night at a dinner in his house, Labelly talked about the idea of a gift. Among Labelly's gifts was French sculptor Frederick Auguste Barthold. Barthold thought a state of liberty. He offered to design the statue. Many people contributed in some way. The French people gave money to the statue. Americans designed and built the pedestal for the state to stand on. The American people raised money to pay for the pedestal. The French engineer Alexander Eiffel, who was famous for his Eiffel Tower in Paris, figured out how to make the heavy state stand. In the years after the state was put up, many immigrants came to the United States through New York. As they entered New York Harbor, they saw the state of liberty holding up her torch. She symbolized a welcome to a land of freedom. Matin, Ozotlik Haikale. The New York Ing Mashur Haikalardan Bere, New York Porto Oral de Joyleshkan. Ushbu ozodlik haykali bu mashalani baland ko'targan ayol timsolidir. Tashrif buyuruvchilar haykal ichiga bemalol kirishlari mumkin. Haykal shunchalik kattaki, uni ikki kishi mashala ichida tura oladi. Haykalning boshqa joylarida ko'plab odamlar turishi ham mumkin. Haykalning og'irligi 225 tonna va balandligi 301 futni tashkil qiladi. Ozodlik haykali 1886-yilda qad rostlagan. Bu Fransiya xalqidan aqshga sovg'a edi. 
yıllar devamında Fransa ve Amerika Koşma Ştatları ortası da Allah'a münasabetler yüzüge kelgen idi. 1776 yılında Fransa Amerika koloniyalarına Angela müstakilliğini alışkı yordan verdi. Fransızlar akışının 100 yıllık üçün özgeçe bir soğuğa kılışını haklaştı. Label'ı Koşma Ştatları'a koyul kılgın tanıklı Fransız idi. Bir günü keçkurun üyde, keçki okat baytı da Label'ı soğuğa koyası haqıda gəpirdi. Label'ının mihmallar orası da Fransız haykal taroşı Frederick August Bartholdi xambor idi. Bartholdi azotli haqıda oyladı. O haykalını layıqasını taklif kıldı. Kup adamlar kaysıdır manada xısa koştular. Fransızlar haykalga pul berişdi. Amerikalıklar haykalının kadroslaşı üçün asosunu layıqalaştırdı ve kurdular. Amerika halka asosunu kuruş üçün pul yığdı. Parijdaki Eiffel münarası bilen maşğur Fransız muhandisi Alexander Eiffel oğur haykalını kandı yıkılıp ornatışını oylap topdu. Haykal ornatılgandan keyingi yıllarda kopla muhacirler New York orkali akışka kırıp gelişti. New York bandargahı kırış Kırış etkende onlar maşalanı kutturken azlatlık haykalını kuruştu. Bu azlatlık diyarıya hoş gelipsiz digen mananı anlatar idi. Let's watch the history of the state of liberty. Kelin bir gelikte azlatlık haykalı haqıdaki tarihini tamoşa kılamız. Located in New York Harbor. The Statue of Liberty is one of the most recognizable landmarks in the world. But what is it doing there? And where did it come from? Officially called Liberty Enlightening the World, the Statue of Liberty was a gift to America from the French in 1886 as a representation of international friendship. But its story really began more than 20 years earlier in 1865 when Frenchman Edouard de Laboulay proposed that France should create a monument for the United States. It would be a long time before Laboulaye's dream was realized. It wasn't until 10 years later that the sculptor Auguste Bartholdi was commissioned to design the statue. The American people agreed to pay for the pedestal for the statue to stand on, while the French people would fund the Statue of Liberty itself. But raising enough money was difficult. The statue was completed in France in 1884, almost 10 years after it was finished, but the pedestal wasn't finished for a few years in April of 1886. The statue was transported in 380 individual pieces, which had in 214 separate crates. Once the pedestal was completed, it took four months to reach the statue. Finally, on October 28, 18 pieces, President Brooklyn decked the statue of an event celebrated by bands, parades, speeches, and fireworks. The Statue of Liberty quickly became a famous landmark. For many immigrants who came to the United States through New York, it was their first sight of their new country. For others, it symbolized the idea of freedom that America was built on. The statue depicts a woman in a robe, representing Libertas, the Roman goddess of liberty. She has a crown head with seven points, said to represent the seven seas, or the seven continents of the earth. She is holding a stone tablet in one hand, which reads July 4, 1776 in Roman numerals, honoring the date of the signing of the Declaration of Independence. In her other hand, she holds high a flame torch, covered in gold leaf. The statue of Lee itself is covered in a copper, less than 2 feet thick. Really, the statue is a big cup and a big. After less than 20 years of standing up in some rain, the copper began to oxidize, to the green color we recognize today. The statue weighs 450,000 pounds, or 225 tons, and stands over 151 feet or 46 meters high, not including the pedestal she stands on. With the pedestal, from the ground to the tip of the torch, the Statue of Liberty stands as tall as a 22-story building. About 4 million people visit the Statue of Liberty every year. Those who go inside it can see a poem by Emma Lazarus, written to help raise money for the construction of the pestle. It reads, in part, Give your tired, your poor, or huddled masses yearning to breathe free, the wretched refuse of your teeming shore. Send these, the homeless, can it toss me? I lift my lamp beside the golden door. Now nearly 130 years old, the Statue of Liberty has long been a symbol of hope and welcome to people seeking freedom and new life in America as well as a symbol of the friendship between France and the United States. It is now also a World Heritage Site, which means that it is considered so special and important that it should be protected and preserved for people all around the world to enjoy. I hope you enjoyed learning about the Statue of Liberty today. Bye till next time! Did you like the video? Video like the Exercise number 3. Circle T. If the sentence is true, 
circle F if the sentence is false. Üçüncü mashup. Foydagi jadvaldagi gaplardagi ma'lumotlar agar to'g'ri bo'lsa, T harfini ustiga aylana chizasiz. Agar jadvaldagi gaplardagi ma'lumotlar noto'g'ri bo'lsa, F harfini ustiga aylana chizasiz. Demak, hurmatli talabalar, qo'ydagi 3-chi mashqda berilgan 6 ta gap ozodlik haykali haqidagi ma'lumotlar bo'lib, u rost yoki yolg'on ekanligi haqidagi ma'lumotlardir. Demak, siz bu jadvaldagi gaplarni to'g'ri yoki yolg'on ekanligini aniqlashingiz kerak bo'ladi. Demak, birinchi misolni tushuntirib beraman. Diqqat bilan eshiting. 1 12 people can stand inside the torch of the state of liberty. Ozodlik haykalining mashalasida 12 kishi tura oladi. Demak, bu boya matndan ko'rib chiqqanimizdek, bu ma'lumot to'g'ri, demak, T harfini ustiga aylana chizamiz. Qolgan misollarni o'zingiz mustaqil bajaring. 2 the United States helped France gain its independence in 1776. 3. Alexander Apple was among the guests at Labelist House. 4. Frederick August Bertholdi was a French engineer. 5. Alexander Apple figured out how to make the state stand. 6. Americans designed the pedestal for the state. Exercise number four. Complete the sentence. Circle the letter of the correct answer. Tortenche match. Gaplarne tolderi. Hoidage bishta birligan tesna bajari. Demek tore job nustuga ailana chizi. One. The people of France wanted to give the United States special. They make branchy musol. Kushma shtatlar ge. They make France halke. Maxus A. Gift. B. Torch. They make Torjao. Gift. Kushma shtatlar ge. France halke. Maxus soga birishna halkegan ede. They make branchy jao. A. Number one, the right answer is A. Gift. Hurmatli talabala, qolgan tesni o'zingiz mustaqil bajaring. 2. France helped the American colonies independence. 3. A famous Frenchman labeled it the United States. 4. Frederick Bartholdi to design the state. 5. The state of liberty stands on it. So, my dear students, it's time to give a homework. Homework is writing an essay, the famous monuments of our country. Chunda qilib hurmatli talabalar, uyga vazifa berish vaqti keldi. Uyga vazifa mamlakatingizning eng mashhur haykallari, monumentlari haqida so, today is online lesson is our. Formatli talabalar, shuning bilan bugungi online darsimiz o'z nihoyasiga yetdi. Xayr, salomat bo'ling. Goodbye with your study. Thank you for your attention.